Hi dolls. Today I'll be working on this groovy standard Barbie from the late 60s. Standard Barbies were released in 1967 as a budget version of the twist and turn Barbie. But unlike her more expensive counterpart, this one has solid legs and a straight waist. She is, in a way, the turning point of Barbie from vintage to mod, having received a complete makeover, leaving behind the more matronly glamour in favor of a fresh, youthful look. As is typical of mod era dolls, the vinyl in her head has lost color. She has sharpie stains all over her body, and she just looks like she could use a little love overall. As a first step, I tried to remove some of the stains using a wet magic eraser sponge, which did something, but definitely not enough. So I covered the spots in benzoyl peroxide, covered everything in plastic wrap, and I let it hang out under the sun for a few days to bleach it. To restore the color back into her face, I used two teaspoons of rose quartz red dye and one teaspoon of petal pink. And I boiled the head for approximately an hour and a half, checking obsessively for any drastic color change. After a few days, the peroxide on the body had dried, and luckily took care of all of the stains. Here, you can already tell how much better the dye made the head look. I begin my paint touch-up by applying matte varnish to protect my base and make sure the acrylic doesn't bleed. Then, I went over it with acrylics to cover any missing paint spots which was mainly just in her lips. Being such a simple sculpt, blush is really a must in her face up, so I mixed two pressed pigments and applied it using a fluffy brush. I painted her fingers and toenails. And to finish it off, I sealed everything with monotorum varnish. For the hair, I start by boiling it straight. And I combed it in place. To make sure the bangs would lay flat, I let it dry with a piece of plastic wrapped around it.
For the hairstyle, I simply took two front sections and tied them in the back. In lieu of the exact shade of pink for the ribbon, I added a pastel one and tied it into a bow. And with that, the restoration is complete! Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe if you enjoyed it. Follow me on Instagram at Wonderland. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video.